to my rehearsal. So now I don't know what to do. I'm hungry. I'm gonna go to Tropical Smoothie and get a smoothie after I go back to the house and get the coupons. And then I'll come back and finish my video about making smoothies. So I'm home now, obviously. The sandwich was actually pretty bad, so I had to come home and like doctor it up based on my mom's suggestions. I need to eat more vegetables, it's something I'm not doing. So I put um, red bell peppers and kale in it, and it was actually bomb. So I'll be doing that from now on. But yeah, I'm home. Now I'm gonna go back and finish editing this video. And I've been editing this video for three days. I need to figure out how to take my editing process and cut it down. So that will be my next goal with my next videos. But for this one, I just wanna get it done. Because you, this is not in your way like that. Mommy, you were mind. supposed to come in front like that. Oh. You didn't. I've always been a reader ever since I was little, so um, being at libraries, just being around books in general makes me feel like I'm a kid again. It makes me feel like I'm at home. Like there's just something about books and libraries and being in places where people read that make me feel safe and in my own little world. So I can't wait to find some random book to read while I have time. Oral B. Oral B. from thinking about how much my peers are farther ahead of me in life than I am and how I have no idea what to do to get to where I need to be. So hopefully these books will take my mind off of that existential crisis that I'm having right now.
at the park that I'm going to be walking through today just to get some fresh air before work and before my performance tonight. Well, it's not a performance, it's a dress rehearsal, but just to get, you know, just fresh air because I haven't been able to in a while. It's funny because a couple years ago, I was hiking this same park with my friends that I no longer hang out with, and I kind of miss them coming back here. I forgot I only have like an hour to uh, hike and I took the long way instead of the short route so I'm gonna have to walk back and this route is really tiring because it just goes like straight up. just finished the trail had a good time and yeah so now I have to go to work so I'm gonna go there um but yeah I love hiking this trail it reminds me again of being a child because I love nature and it's just full of nature and green and it's beautiful so stayed in bed till like one so I figured I'd take this day for myself because I have my first show today um, and then the next show is tomorrow so I wanted to get some good rest before I go through this whole thing but yeah that's what I'm doing got my hair done for the show and I'm really hungry so I'm gonna eat breakfast I am making my own breakfast we're gonna see how it works because I've never tried this before so
So guys, what we're doing? We're at Bowser Theater, home of the theatrical outlet. Outfit? Oh, Me no. and AJ okay. will be performing in the Mad Dance Festival in Atlanta, Georgia. great show we got a lot of compliments on our piece so tomorrow's the last day doing it and then after that i have classes summer classes starting but yeah um i just i hope that i get better as a dancer and i hope that dance is something i get to do for the rest of my life because i just i love performing and i and as much as validation isn't healthy i love being able to hear people say your performance, you know, made me cry, or your performance really touched me, or your performance made me laugh, or it made me happy. I just loved having people be affected by what I do on the stage. So, I don't know, I hope this continues for a long time. Moment had to be the best, the pillar, the climax of everything. 